But I think the nice thing about this collaborative is the majority of us are the only educators on site. So uh, particularly for me as the only person on site, that, um, it gives me a sounding board. So it's a great, as we evaluate programs, I can talk to other educators who are experiencing the same program and we can evaluate and improve upon the program. So I think from that vantage point, the, it's, the collaboration has been very beneficial for us. We sort of ignored the issue of trying to develop a programmatic budget for the first two years. Um, and that is, it's not that, it, I don't think any of us are concerned with it all being perfectly even. We're just concerned with everyone being able to do what they can, honestly. And that's a big deal. If you go into it saying every penny has to be equal and it's all, it's never going to work and you're going to end up with people frustrated and instead what we've done is we've gone into it saying here's our programmatic budget from the last two years what can you afford to do and I think even extending beyond budget but just staffing mm -hmm. the different programs how we logistically take registrations we've worked together at really trying to see who can afford you know who has time to take these registrations and then someone else can step in and do another job so it's kind of balancing all that mm -hmm. together which I think has made it very effective I was talking to a teacher, or a, to a grant person, and he said, well, we're just running the whole time. And I said, well, maybe you, sh you know, I would, we, we would love for you to have a deeper experience. And he, was, and he said, oh, well, well, we're being organized by a tour group, and, and we can't, you know, we just want the teachers to see everything so that they can make the decision about coming back later with their students. But what they're modeling is the way that then the students are going to experience it as well.